the secret to everything. Your wheel, your spindle, your hand carters, and even your hands. Everything answers to the nectar of Frigga, that which feeds your tools. Spoon oil. You heard me right. Spoon oil is the ultimate in tool care. Now, what the heck is it? Spoon oil, or sometimes called cutting board cream, is a mixture of beeswax and mineral oil, which can be used to moisturize and seal wood. It is food safe, unlike many wood sealants, which can be toxic and leach in the food, which is why it's perfect for your salad bowls, wooden spoons, and cutting boards. When it comes to wooden fiber tools, this stuff is a workhorse. I like to use it on my antique wheels, my carters, my combs, my nostapinus, my looms, my spindles. If it doesn't have a clear coat and is made of wood, it gets treated with spoon oil. If you don't oil wood, it will eventually dry out and crack. The oil and wax will also help prevent water from soaking in, which can cause the wood to swell or warp. Now, if you're lazy, like I sometimes am, you can buy pre-made spoon oil. It isn't terribly expensive. However, the best spoon oil I have ever used came from a recipe from my good friend Karen of Bob and Weave. Okay, are you ready? One part beeswax, four parts mineral oil. That's it. That's the recipe. All right, so it is a little more complicated than that. You'll need to melt the beeswax. I use a metal bowl and pot as a double boiler to melt the wax, just like I'd melt baking chocolate. Beeswax comes in many forms, and whether it's straight from the comb, brick form, or pellets like what I'm using, just make sure that the wax you are using is free of honey or other impurities. Once the wax is melted, you can add your mineral oil and mix until the two are combined. Put it in a jar with a lid and you're ready to rock and roll. It will firm up into a nice thick consistency which won't drip off the surface you're working it into. Then all you do is use a lint-free cloth to work the oil into the wooden surface. Allow the wood to soak up the oil and apply another layer. Keep applying spoon oil until your wood stops absorbing it. Then bask in the glory of our well cared for tools. If you like what you see, make sure that you hit that subscribe button so that you're following our YouTube channel and that'll let you know when we get new content. Also make sure that you follow us at lutherian.com.